Oh, hello. Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today, from the new Buttrick cookbook from the uh, School of Economics at Cornell in 1924, we're going to be making a sandwich that doesn't have a name, uh, so I'm going to call it the sweet beef sandwich. Keep in mind, there are no amounts given in this recipe. So to minced corned beef, we add mustard. And that was the meat. Here comes the sweet Boston brown bread. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's give this sweet meat sandwich a go. It's not bad. You got the corned beef, obviously, the tanginess of the mustard, and then this brown bread is sweetened with molasses. It's actually kind of interesting. I think I kind of like it, but I do want to plus it up. I'm going to add something a little salty, some hickory sticks. These are potato sticks that are uh, hickory smoked. They were sent out by Sandwich Dad. Thank you, Sandwich Dad. Okay, let's give this sweet meat sandwich plus up with those salty hickory sticks. Oh, I like it. It adds salt, which is a flavor enhancer and it adds texture to the sandwich. And the hickory sticks are gonna go with mustard. It's potatoes. Well, I have to admit, I was pleasantly surprised by the original sweet meat sandwich. The tang of the mustard with the corned beef and then playing off the sweetness of the Boston brown bread. That was pretty good. I'm gonna give that a six and a half. Plus up with the hickory sticks, brought a little crunch, brought a little salt, seven and a half. That is tasty. I'm definitely gonna finish this. I don't know that I would make this again per se, but it was pretty tasty. Maybe I'd make it as an appetizer for a cocktail party or something, but yeah. All right, see you tomorrow.